My condition is, is nystagmus. It's basically, um, I had it from birth, and it, my eyes are constantly like moving and stuff like that. And because of that, I'm legally blind. Now, this is my 13th New York City. Oh, okay. But it's the first time I'm running the full marathon with a, with a guy. The guy will take the pressure off of me because I can't navigate the bumps, the cracks, the potholes on the street. Um, my eyes deteriorated over the, the past few years even more. And I can't see the water station, so she's going to help me, you know, let me know when the water stations are coming up, the mile markers, and uh, I can basically run the marathon free and not have to worry about those, you know, things. Okay. Now, and to yell at him when he slows yeah, down. Yeah, exactly. Go <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> When I run, I, I look pretty much all, all the time on the ground because I can't really look straight ahead. If somebody's coming at me, I do see a shape coming at me, but if they wave or they said my name, I won't know who it is unless I recognize the voice. John has to run the first half with the other four members of the Foot Locker Five Barrel Challenge. And so it will be slower than usual for him the first half. Um, and so we're both kind of treating it as a long training run. He has another marathon coming up soon and I have another one in a couple of weeks. So we're using it as more a long training run than a full out race. After the halfway point, we could take off and basically run our own race from that point on. And I'm excited. To, um, to be doing this is a great opportunity and I get to run with one of my idols which is Michelle right here I mean I've been following her blog she's, she's a great runner she does triathlon she does everything and to me to have her as a guide it just makes it more fun it give me a chance to show people that are visually impaired or legally blind like myself or even blind totally that we can still fulfill our dreams and do what we want to do even though we have this impairment it's the way I relieve stress the way I deal with everyday life and uh, without running I don't think I would be complete.